Hey guys, thanks for tuning in today. Today I'm going to do a unboxing and uh, this unboxing is going to be of the FDE Mark II 5.7 by 28 millimeter by FN Herstal, Belgium. So without ado, let's get started. This is the kind of box it comes in. It's a hard, it, it's a big box. Uh, I like the older boxes that they used to have on these, but this is a big, heavy box, uh, you know. So let's go ahead and open it up. Okay, and we open up the box. We have in here uh, a few things. This little safety magazine or pamphlet. We have a lock. Nobody ever uses those. We have a um, confirm your purchase coupon. We have a uh, youth handgun safety notice. Comes with a little manual. FN manual of the gun, proper operation and things. You get a little warning here about ammunition. It says use only specially coated loaded ammunition. Uh, they says you should use the SS-195, SS-197, Federal, uh, Military is SS-190, L-191, 193, 198 LF. It says some SS-195 rounds may cause performance issue when used in the 5.7. Therefore, optimal uh, operation, they recommend 197 SR and Federal AE 5728A ammunition. Well that's interesting. They said the 195s aren't the best. So, um, but the SS-198 is really nice. Okay, so let's get started on the review. Uh, comes with three magazines also. A spent shell casing and um, it has this sticker on the top, but I took this sticker off. There's normally a sticker right down here and I took that sticker off and put it over there. So let's go ahead and take a look at the gun and uh, let's go ahead and lay the uh, case to the side. Okay, lay it there. And let's get started. I'll just bring a little bit more focus in. Show you it's empty. Okay, no bullets in it. See? Should be able to see light there. Daylight. Okay. Uh, 5.7 is polymer. And what it has is a polymer on top here. Uh, it's a one piece metal slide underneath here. This is a polymer. Gives you some cocking serrations in the front. So when you. Okay. It will not fire unless you put the magazine in there because it has a. Uh, this kind of, right? It's just shot. Uh, it has a indicator right here, chamber, a loaded chamber indicator. Uh, it has the rear front cock insertions. It has your white dot adjustable sights. Back here is adjustable. This is a blade. Okay, pretty straightforward. It does have a rail here, a tiny rail for light or for uh, whatever else you're going to put in there, light, laser. Very uh, aggressive stippling around here. Now this is the FDE model. Tell me what you think of it. This is the uh, flat dark earth. I kind of like the flat dark earth. So uh, I'll probably keep this with flat dark earth. I kind of like it. Um, it has a ambidextrous safety. See that? Okay, and your magazine release right there. Okay, uh, it does come with three 20 round magazines. These are the newer type. You see the big difference here? It has this like uh, triangle there. That triangle gives it more strength. And I'll give you an example. So when you put the bullets in, you'll see how it lines up there. See how they line it? Let me get the camera down a little bit more. 
how that goes in there. And then uh, these here are the Hornady. Like I say, there's a lot of different uh, types of ammunition you can get for these. This is the round that it's using. It actually was originally a rifle bullet that they're using in a handgun. 5.7, definitely a keeper. And with everything that's going on right now with the bands, you know if Hillary gets in, this gun is going to be number one band gun. So, really, if you're getting it, get two. Get two. Get two guns, and um, then you'll have a real nice defensive. I mean, you don't really need nothing else. You have, have two of these babies. You know, you get two FDEs or get a, a black and an FDE. Because they're very good. Now, takedown is very uh, simple on the gun. Basically, pull it a little bit back like a Glock, and there's this button. You push it this way, all the way, and you hold it. Okay. And then that will loosen up your slide. You can see that takes your slide open. And uh, let me go ahead and show you the frame part. You can see it's brand new, it's not even dirty. So that's inside the frame there. And I'll show you how the actually when you put the magazine out, how it works. Okay. This is uh, right here. It would rest against the bullet and bring your slide release up. The safety, actually, there's a little nib here. See this little nib for the magazine to cut? And it pushes up on a, there's a little uh, below this here. Let me see if can point with. Let's see if we can see in there. Below here, right there, that there. That pushes it up. And up in here, it engages it. So this is just basically work like that. Okay. And pretty straightforward. The uh, slide. See, pretty straightforward. Taking it down is pull forward, pull out the barrel. Here's your barrel. Has a snap ring in there, holds the spring cap captive. Now this one hasn't been polished, but I probably will polish that. And it's a one-piece slide, you can see. The USG has a two-piece. It's like welded over here or something. Put it back in. You just basically take it, push it forward, yep. take your gun, and uh, make sure this is all the way back. Okay. okay make sure that's back. Put it in lightning. It's kind of just drop it on. And you want to make sure that uh, this is lined up. So that's lined up. And just push it back. Now it's back. Pretty straightforward. Like I say, the, now you really have to think about uh, the uh, whole persona of the whole gun environment, how it is today. You know, they're going to want to um, definitely take everything away. So uh, it, it's really a good time if you're even thinking of 5.7. 5.7s, um, like I say, depending on what you're going to spend, uh, you can get these probably for about 13, 12, 13. It is an animal of a gun. It's a really nice gun to have. Highly recommend it. Um, uh, this is the 5.7 by FNH USA. Fredericksburg, uh, Virginia is the importer, but it is FN Herstal, Belgium. But it's a nice gun. The big difference is with the M. Uh, MK2s or Mark IIs are the front cocking serrations, the reinforced rear sight, the reinforced triangle on the uh, right here, this part here in the center here, reinforced the triangle on the on the uh, magazine, and uh, one piece slide underneath here. Uh, they did do some enhancements on the trigger. Nice gun, good looking. I think it's a lot better looking than the USG. Thanks a lot for tuning into my video and have a great day.